Now we got the funny looking Elmo that looks like a frog. I think he I think he looks he looks pretty cool, I reckon. But now I'm still gonna wait. I don't know if y'all can see the face or not, but I'm gonna uh wait and see it after the uh, uh video if she still wants it. Um I think I'm gonna start putting it, this video up. Before I put any other video up, put it up first. All right, we're going to put Elmo over here. <coughs> and we are going to cut this because we don't need this. So if I can't cut, who cares? Let's just get rid of it. And we're going to make an outfit for it. And I think I'm going to go with that color. See if we can't lay it out here and see what color we want to go out with. So we got two darks, one medium, and two lights. So I am thinking that I want to go with the two dots. I think those would be good. Alright, now what we're going to have to have is that pattern back out here. I wonder if they have a pair of pants in this pattern. If they do, then that's the better way to go than trying to make an outfit. So let's pull out our paperwork here. Alright, this is the doll. Find the other paper. There's the dress. Well, I don't see nothing on this one. So this one here ain't going to help me now. Let's check this one out. Open it up and take a look. Are you sure she had yeah she got bloomers all right we're going to use the bloomers for the pattern all right so let me get all this over here straightened out and then we'll be back it looks like uh yeah well yeah i have to agree yep that living room looks horrible. Alright, I could not use that one. I did not have enough material to do it. And I have a blue for the pants. And I've got four layers here. So, what we're going to do is I want to make uh, the shirts longer. About two inches longer to make sure... That I have enough to do it. And there's. Let's see, where's it at? Where's Elmo? Alright. This is the back. Oh, wait a minute. I believe I'm doing it wrong. Hold on. We want to make sure we got a pattern on our right. Um, okay, center back line. Okay. This is the seam. Well, where's the armhole? That's the armhole right here. So really, I need to have it this way for the back. 
cut off for left side. Well, wait a minute, where's this cut on fold thing at? Right here. This one right here is the cut on fold. I got them backwards. Alright, we can handle this. <laughs> I think we can. Alright, let's put this one on here. Huh? Let's go down some. So I want to make sure that I got room over here because I want to take some of this and I'm going to cut the string, uh, strips off. When I get done with this, I'm going to use this on my rug in there. Party horror. Alright, now we got we got them right. This right here is cut on fold. And I want to go down about two inches. Make sure. Yeah, it'll work. But I'll tell you what, to make sure it will work, we're going to go down two and a half inches. So I am going to mark that one. So it will be cut it that way. Alright, now we're going to go over here. We're going to go to this one. And we're going to cut it down also. So we'll make sure that it is lined up and long enough for Elmo. So now we got those done. I could be happy with that. So that's what we're gonna do. I don't want to cut that off because I can use that strip all the way down there to uh, work on my uh, alright anyway we're doing that there we go see what we can do here this one is the back. And I hope this works out just fine. Alright. Alright, let's see what we can do about cutting this one out. Make them into strips. Oh, they still touch down any fucking way. Well, when men get mad, they get mad, don't they? And they're gangs. That piece may be worth keeping. Don't cut. We are done with this one. And what did I do with the other one? Oh no. Oh, let's turn up. Nope. Oh, come on now, Sandy. You did not. Yeah, you did too. You lost it. Alright, so here we go. Now, one of them says that we need to cut it down. Cut that out right. That's his armpit, ain't it? No, it goes this way. Dad damn it. We're here. I already go by the line. It's okay. We're not gonna cry about it. We got the material to do better. Whoa. Alright, now. The line needs to go this way. Boy, this is making me mad. Not paying attention. Maybe I need some more light. 
Alright, let's do this. Alright. Let's get this one right here out of the way. Where's my... Oh, there it is. Alright. I'm just going to leave that little bit on there. I hear somebody trying to move around in there, Rick. She hungry? It's probably been, yeah, it's been about three hours deal. Are you kidding? Uh, yeah. Alright. Alright, I'm happy with that. Alright, now that one is right. This one is wrong. So we're gonna go down and we're gonna do this one again. I'm gonna look and make sure it's right. Alright. Cut this out and I'll make her a bottle. Okay? Let me cut this out and then I'll make her a bottle. I know she ain't, but you know she's going to be. Yep. Alright, now it says to cut part of one off, but I'm not going to cut it on account of giving me enough to put on for Velcro. And I can, we can adjust it. And hopefully it'll work. Yeah, it's going to work for Elmo. Now we're going to need a, like a collar or something around the top. So I'm going to have to do that in a little bit. And hopefully I can get something out of here or out of one of these to make a collar with. But for right now, I need to go take care of my baby. So we'll be back. And I'm going to look over in pants again and see if I can't cut like on a fold. John's just saying a dog look like bullet. Alright. I left a little bit for the good hem and make sure... Yep, that there'd be enough room for it and all. So hopefully it'll turn out. All right, now we have this done, and we're going to want to take these pins out. I'm going to start with the pants first. I want to start with the pants first. All right, so... Shove this butt down in half. Both of the babies are up. So Emmy will probably... Uh, Kayla will probably find her way back in here. Alright. So. See what we could do. Come on. Open up here. So now we got pants. Now. I think. What we need to do. Do it this way. Now I want to put pockets on them. So we're going to work on some pockets right here. Come on, get out of here. And I think that is going to work for the pockets. Now what we want to do, i got four here, I only need two. Anyway, we're going to put that in half. 
get two of them gone because if I don't may put them all way up and I don't want to do that so I'm gonna have that what are y'all doing for dinner tonight I'm gonna make sandwich oh okay I've got some uh, fried chicken and rice that I was gonna make Oh, well, if you want to do that, then go right on ahead. Um, I actually kind of forgot Rick was off work tonight, and I got a family size, but I don't know if it's going to be enough for everybody. So, what do we need to do? Um. Do I need to go get more? Nah, um. Let's see. Let's put one on this side, right about right here, and then we're going to put one... On this side. Sorry, Rick. I didn't mean to forget you like that. Well, you don't know he wasn't going to work. Well, he did tell me at one point in time that he's off on the weekends. Yeah. But I didn't remember that. So All I right. Know. And, and I think that will work. And we're, before we do anything, we're going to make sure that it works. If you want to cook that for you and her, and I'll cook the sandwich for us. Especially yeah, we're I, mean, I don't I don't know. It might feed everybody. It might not. <laughs> Do both these go in the freezer? Yeah. Even if I'm cooking them tonight? It don't matter. If you're cooking them tonight, it don't matter where you put them at. Alright. Now, we're going to put this pocket on this side. Now, if this is wrong, it will tell. And then we're going to put it. Yeah, it will. We're right. We're right on it. So now we got back pockets. So I'm happy about that. Now we gotta sew them down. Oh, yeah. That's cool. There we go. Alrighty. So now then what we're gonna do is we're gonna sew these down on here and uh, first we're going to have to put a hem across the top of them. Clip, clip, clip. Clip. I'm going to put my pin back here so I will remember. My pin right here so I will remember. And we're going to fold it over. I need to turn the light on in here. Besides just this one. Alright, I'm going to sew these down on here. And then when I get done, I'm going to be back. All right, I got the pockets on. So now what we're going to do is we're going to turn this over on top of this. And we're going to sew from here all the way down here. I was doing the pockets and I like it slow so I can keep up with the uh, keep up with what I'm doing here. Get rid of all this string. Alright, I don't know how much you've seen of it. I need me a camera person. I think Kate's would do pretty good with it. Alright, now. I think my next thing is I like to put my hem in while it's flat. So I figured I better put in a small hem all the way down. Get some clips going here. And, uh, let's get these clips so I can use them up too. There we go. Now we'll sew this down. And then I think... I'm not for sure what's going to be next. But we'll look at it when I get down. Let's sew that down. Because we want it to look good. I hope. I want it to bud. Bud. Uh-oh. My fold is coming unfolded here. Yeah. 
I need to find me a new needle too and change my needle. Yeah, my needle needs to be changed. I can tell by the way it's acting. Alright, so now we got this. Let's try it and see what it looks like. So that's going to go in there. Let's go over a little bit more. Now we're going to, I believe we're going to want to, ooh, gosh, look how big this is over here. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm-mm. If I do that, I'm not going to like that. Because that's going to be really, really big. So I'm going to have to see what I can do about trimming this down. Alright. Let's go with our next thing that we need to do. And that's hemming the bottom of the pants. <laughs> so I can figure out what to do on one of these spaces here. So I like to have my hem. Go ahead and put my hem in. get them done all right I'm gonna go ahead and get off of here and I'm gonna change my needle and I'm gonna hem these down and see what we need to do after we get this done because somewhere something's got to go Alrighty. Now then, I got a fresh needle, and I also found elastic. So, what we're going to do from here is we're going to see how much elastic we need to put around him. All right. Make it comfortable for him. This way, I mom always taught me to do it, and do it about two, one and a half to two inches. I'd still make it too big. That's what mom used to do all the time. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'd looked at it wrong, but I don't think I'm because it's not. It's going to be too big. Let's cut it down to what size it should, like that. Now then, that ought to give it to us really good. All right. So, let's get us a pen. If I can reach back here. Hello. Let me get a pen. So we can make it go through the top. I'm up in it $5 a week to $30 total a week to help out with a uh, water bill. Okay. Yep. Yeah. What? Alright. Uh, is she coming? I think John, uh, Rick's talking to you. No, he's talking to you, Dominic. Uh, no, I was asking you if that is it. Oh, I don't know. I have no idea. No, I was asking him if that girl was coming. Oh, well. He you thought he was, he th yeah, he thought you was talking to me. Okay. Fast forward this part. No. All right. 
now we've got strings that are bothering me. Now we got this done. Let's see if I can't make this one stay. Pull this one out a little bit. Alright. So now we're going to take this one. I'll come on, screw a little bit more on it. I don't want that much. I want about that much. All right. Now we're going to sew this down all the way down through there. I doubt, Rick, that she will come. Are you talking about, uh, yeah. Amanda? Can Karen. Okay. Yeah, Jonathan says Amanda won't come. All right, let's try this out and see if it'll if it'll work, or if I need to shorten it down or anything. What needs to happen from here? I think that hit out pretty good. That hit pretty good. Alright. So we're happy with that. Cut this off. There we go. Now, what we want to do is sew down in between, and we should be done with the pants. Let's try them on him. Let's see if we ain't got a good pair of pants for him. And get rid of all these strings. Uh, Do you know how to play Uno? Oh, you're recording. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're fine. Yeah, I know how to play Uno. I'm going to try to get a game going with her. And you, you want to join in, that would be fun too. Alrighty. I don't know where we can play it at. <laughs> yeah. Set it up right here. Move all this stuff around. Yeah, I'll we'll just slide it over. If you think that can happen. I don't know. <laughs> I'm looking to see what I need to cook with tonight. Oh, everything's up there. Okay. What, buddy? I ain't doing nothing. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here. I think I'm done running around for a day. Wait on her to get here about 8 o'clock. All right. There is him a pair of pants, and here's what the back of them looks like. All right, I think we're going to work on the shirt, and then we'll work on a pair of shoes for him. All right, I'll see you all for the next one, the shirt. How to donate to poor man sewing. You mash on poor man sewing. Then you mash right here on poor man's sewing. You go up here and you look for a bout. And right here is poor man's sewing. It's people like you that help this channel out. I can buy things that I do cannot 
necessarily be able to afford when I need them. And it is very much appreciated. I really do mean it from the heart. And may Jesus richly bless you in your happiness and health.